Hey, what's going on, guys? It is Zeta here, and welcome to The Wolf Among Us. Now, this is a tell, telltale game that came out quite a few years ago, but I just recently found out that Season 2 is coming out. Not, I think sometime next year or something like that. I'm not entirely sure, but I wanted to play it because I'm actually extremely hyped for Season 2 because... Not gonna lie, this game is really cool. Like the whole idea of it. Now, I know me saying that makes me sound like I've played this game. I haven't. I haven't. So that's why I chose to play it now and get ready for season two. So yeah, let's just hop on into it. And yeah, start episode one. Yeet. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tolerated by how you play. Once upon a time in New York City, there lived a community of fairy tale characters known as Fable Town. The fables who lived there arrived hundreds of years ago after they were exiled from their homelands. Through the use of magic called Glamour, they have protected their secret community from the mundane world. Sheriff Bigby Wolf protects them from each other. Again, if you missed it, a record for the date. Hottest ever in June. Uh, 103 now. That humidity looks low, but remember, the hotter the air is, the more moisture it can hold. So 103 with 31% humidity is a lot more humid than, say, 73 with 31% humidity. Ooh. Big old it's city. Out there. The Wolf Among Us. Heck yeah. Thank you, Mr. Taxi. Tenement building South Bronx sometime after midnight. Hello, Mr. Toad. Oh, shit. Big B. Listen, mate, I, I know I don't look human. It's a problem, I get it. I just stepped out the apartment for just a second to see what kind of damage this drunk shit is doing. Just cut me a break, yeah? I'll get me glamour first thing in the morning. Cross my arm. No need to No harm pass. done. Look, no harm done. I'll give you a pass, but listen. If you can't afford to look human, you're going to the farm. It's as simple as that. You can't send me up to live with those animals. Yes, I can. I'm the sheriff. You know what I mean. Go see a witch. Get a glamour. Big B, they're bleeding me dry, mate. The quality of the spell goes down, but the rates keep climbing up. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I don't make the rules. Sorry. Oof. I can't give you a free pass on this, Toad. My hands are tied. Right, right. There's too much at stake. Whatever I would. It costs, it's worth it. You don't. Want me catching you out of glamour again? Fucking hell! See? This is what I told you about, Sheriff. You're just gonna stand there, do something, Big B, before he completely tears up the place. So, what am I walking into exactly? Exactly. Uh, Woodsman's on another bender. He's been going on like that for hours. Turn this place to dust if you let him. He's in a fucking rage. This is the last straw, Big B. He has to go. All right, I'm going up. Fine. I'm heading up. Get your glamour. Furry prick job shite. Tell me how to spend my money. Oi. Dad, the lights are shaking again. What did I say? 
You want a big bad wolf to take you away? No. Then get that fuck back inside. Jesus. It's just the kid. You're gonna know who I fucking am, you hear me? Hey, look at me. What's this? Just stop, okay? You're drunk. Let go. Put the phone up, it's annoying. Take a look. Take a good look. You know who I am now? I'll hey. knock. God damn you! Oh, you know whoa, 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 hey, hey! hey. You've got something on your face. Fuck are you talking about, you stupid <laughs> Heck yeah. I'll fucking kill you. All right, everyone. <laughs> okay. What are you going to fucking do, huh? Get the fuck out of the way before you get the axe again. You're drunk, You're drunk, man. all right? Think this through. If you keep on like this, I won't have any choice but to put you down. Put me down? You got a shit fucking memory, Wolf. That's not how it went last time. This isn't last time. Oh. You gotta calm down. Over the couch. Had enough? At least fucking challenge uh, 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 yeah yeah uh, yeah uh, yeah ha <laughs> <laughs> you can't touch me The bottle. Bang. Go fuck yourself. Uh, yeah. You. Punch. 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 Oh, there's an axe right there. Oh, I didn't know. I, I suspected it was going to be a Q. Oh. Ooh. Bonk. Hecky. You should probably get out of here. Look, I'm not leaving until I get what's mine. You're not getting shit, bitch. Oh. I'll fucking put you on the ground. Shut up. Oh, fucking shit. You bug my jaw, you bastard. <laughs> and still you talk. Fuck you. Ha. Shit. What the hell is going on? What happened? A little misunderstanding that turned into a real shit show. Wrong eye. Don't worry. You saw the best bits. There's more where that came from, girly. Knock it off. Look, this is just the start of a shitty night for me. I just need the money he owes me, then I can go. Are you all right? I'm hunky-dory. Thanks for asking. What, what's your name? Whatever you'd like it to be, handsome. Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Sorry, Sheriff. Wouldn't want to add any difficulty to your night. Why was he hitting you? He asked me if I recognized him, knew who he was. I said I didn't. He started beating on me. Then you showed up, started beating on him. That about cover it, hon? I'm the woodsman, you whore. I saved Little Red Riding Hood from this monster. I cut this fucker open and filled his belly full of <laughs> stones and threw him in the fucking river. That's who the fuck I am, you stupid bitch. Hey, hey what did I say about that word? Come on. Oh. 
Well, that is a smooth landing. My car. Oh, okay. Give me a second. Oh, no, by all means. Take your time. Make yourself comfortable. Uh, sorry about the car. We ended up going out the window. Couldn't be avoided. I can't be mad at you. I called you, and you come to help. I can't be mad. But even when you help, things end up more fucked than they started. I did launch him out the window. Well, at least you're not fucking dead. Huh? Oh. No. No. Oh, oh, wait, what? Yeah. I know you're fucking in there. I got it all the way. What the heck? I'm getting killed. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. What? Is he still alive? Oh, okay. Thank you. Thanks. Don't mention it. I'm just getting what he owes me. You all right back there? I mean, your eyes and the teeth. You're not really supposed to do that, are you? Not if I can avoid it. Great. The guy's got an axe in his brain. He's not feeling that. It's more for me. He'll be I'll kill you, you fucking bitch. Let me help you. <laughs> He's had enough. He's a feeble. Son of a bitch can take plenty. Fair enough. Get a new lighter. Here. Thanks. Who do you work for, really? These lips are sealed. Sorry. Hey, you like my ribbon? Beautiful. Thank you. You look... She looks like she's uncertain of that. I feel like we've met before. We probably have. We all sort of knew each other at one point or another. But things change, I guess. I guess. Oh, he's gone. He's up and out of there. Shit. Stop. We don't have to make any more of a thing out of it than it already is. Are you sure? Uh, he's had enough. For tonight, at least. Wouldn't be surprised if he has an axe to grind, though. This fall. That wasn't intentional. Sorry. How am 
much was the Oja? A hundred. I'm guessing it'd be bad for you to show up empty-handed. I'll be fine. I'll give her money. Let's see, I've got, uh, it's 20. 58. It's all I got. Uh, it'll help, right? Take it. It's okay. I'll be fine. You've done enough, really. Nope, take it. Just take the money, okay? You got me out of a bad situation back there. Thanks. I'm still gonna need a statement. I have to go drop off what I have. Meet me back at my office, then. It's a little late for an office visit, Sheriff. I'll swing by your apartment. How do you know where I... You live in the smallest apartment in the woodlands. Everyone knows that. Ha. Good to know. You should get cleaned up. You look like shit. And I don't use that term lightly. Some of these look pretty bad. I clean up okay. I'll believe it when I see it. Hey. Hi. I need to tell you something. What is it? You're not as bad as everyone says you are. I'll see you around, Wolf. Well, damn. Tail Game presents The Wolf Among Us. Big Bad Wolf, Episode 1, Faith. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> hey. My apartment. Stay off the grass. Ah. Okay. Who's that? Come on out. All right, all right. Beauty. Hello, Big B. I wasn't expecting anyone. Oh, why'd you hide? A little odd. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. No, you can't. That doesn't explain why you're here. Damn it, I'm late. Please, Big B. Promise me you won't tell Beast you saw me. He worries too much as it is. I promise. You promise? I promise. Thank you, Big B. I'll explain it all to you later. I will, but I have to go. Well, what the hell? Thank you for trusting me. 
Really, I... I appreciate Bigby. Sure. So now we go home. No, nope, cops asleep. Any mail? Been a while since I got any mail. Seventh day in a row. I guess no one just wants to get on your bad side. What number was I? 204? Wait, I my name was scratched out? Okay. I guess that's a thing. It be Bigby. Hey, wait up. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? Uh, I haven't seen nope. her. I haven't seen her. Oh, okay. Sorry to bother you. Damn it. Something's going on. Big B's apartment. <laughs> Doesn't want it. Should have cracked a window. Hmm. What a night. Yeah, no kidding, dude. Got thrown out a window and onto a car. What's in your fridge? Why do I even own this? Should have got a smaller one. I don't know. There's probably nothing in the freezer either. What the f shit? No. Hey, Colin. Get up. All right. Huh. Hey, Big B. I'm in your chair, huh? I've only got the one. So, yeah. I don't know why you give me that look, man. Got a smoke? Hey, hey. Thanks. A couple thousand more of these will be even on that house you owe me. <laughs> stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like. I okay? won't. You haven't been there. Calm down. I'm not sending you back. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Do with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's reason enough for me to have definitely been offered a drink, but, uh, it would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. 
It also would have shown everyone how different you are now. That was all you were saying I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. Wow. So, everyone hates me. Nah, I'm just giving you shit. I'm doing my best here. Clearly that is not true. What with the selfishness with the bourbon. But, uh, no. Um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. Oops. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Sorry. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. Oops. Who'd you get in a fight with? A fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. It wasn't my, my fault. fault. I get the impression you say that a lot. It wasn't. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. No. Not everyone. Name one. Beauty. Beauty. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I told her I'd lie for her. <laughs> right. Yeah. That's real nice of you. It's honest. <laughs> Life is easier with friends, Bigby. And we live a long fucking time. I know you like this whole lone wolf thing you got going for yourself. But I've seen the way you look at snow, okay? You're not fooling me. Will you shut up? Well, maybe if my throat wasn't so parched, I wouldn't have to keep talking. Wait, that doesn't make Just sense. Just give me a drink, please. Colin, enough already. I haven't slept in two days. I went out a second story window, and I want to get in two seconds of shut eye before I. No, oh my Look, days. If I give you this, will you let me sleep? Yeah, yeah, all right. Probably. Yeah, all right, here you go. Thanks, Big B. And now we sleep. Alrighty guys, well, I'm actually going to end off the first episode there. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Also leave a comment down below what game you guys will want to see on my channel. But uh, yeah guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.